Now this is how I made a flex head wrench from a wrench just like this one. The first step was to cut through right here and cut off the head. And once you've done that, you're going to have a piece that looks like this. Now this is about a quarter inch from this side to that side. And it's about a half an inch deep from the top to here. This is a 3 16 hole. And you have probably just a little bit better than a, an eighth of an inch here, 150th hour or so. And this is quite flexible. Nothing is actually precision about this. Well, after you've done that, after you've done that, you're going to create a slot in this part of the wrench, the handle part, that's a, about a quarter of an inch, which will be accommodating this part here that fits into it. Now, the, the hole here, uh, we drill through with a number 25 drill, which is 149 and a half thou, and this is the tab drill for a 1024 screw. So this side only will be tapping for a 1024 thread. You might want to open this side a little, a little more so it's a little easier to, to get the screw in. Now the screw is the 1024 screw. Uh, I've used this button head screw because it uh, is going to be smoother. And uh, simply assemble the two parts together and place the screw in the hole. And once you've screwed that in there, oh, I don't have the wrench right here, but you can see how this works. Pretty simple to do. All you need is a, a wrench to work with. If you'd like to be notified of other new modifications, please click on the subscribe button. Thanks for watching.